Intensive care that's room 203 down the hall. Okay. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. It wasn't really our idea, but hey. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You were too far to G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? <laughs> Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the humans would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? Yeah, I'm sure the big hotshot politician wants blood on his hands. That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much, and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you, you take out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. Oh yeah? And how's that? This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Please take a look at this tool! a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems. Assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. Yeah, no shit like we're gonna stop now. Then no shit. Thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we have. The rest is in your hands. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We just like killing freaks. If you want to help, you're more than welcome. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. Free to stay as long as you like. You can visit the human haven yourself, by the way. We don't know exactly what makes humans comfortable, but I hope you like how we've set things up. message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yep, and he even gave us this weird thing we could send humans with. God damn. Could you, you got it easy. Talk, Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Uh, hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and uh, you might want to hit up the auto chef store, too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs you're selling can be pretty helpful. Oh my god. Oh. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh. 
I'm all safe. I'm all safe. Byron, don't do this now. Just go sit down. <laughs> I'm serious. No more bounties until you get a jetpack from Mr. Keep. Hey, Uncle Bob. Exactly how you feel. May I? No, thank you. I don't want this anymore. I, I'm so sorry. This is all I thought that you never should have asked you to come here. You think I'm kidding? You're barely gonna be able to get around this universe without a jetpack. I don't know how you managed to get this far. Well, thank you, then. Ooh! Ooh, it's the beast, it's the beast! Run, Judy, run! Get out of here. I'm not leaving her alone with you. Bullshit! Hey, leave him alone! Don't you think you've done enough already? Who are you talking about? You know exactly what I'm talking about. Leave us alone. Come on, come on, baby. I don't belong to you. You just do what I tell you. No! <laughs> yeah! Seriously. Go get a damn jetpack. Don't you dare touch her off, Scarlet. Shut your fucking eyes. Oh, leave me to you, little weasel. You okay, boss? I'll get you for this, bitch. You're gonna pay for this. You're gonna pay for this. You need a wheelchair? Are you fucking nuts? <laughs> They're too small. Requesting him? Don't you know the world's famous Dr. Wachenstein? No, I don't. I am merely a colleague. <laughs> Dr. Rosenthal's in Section C. Section C, that's a good number. Thank you so much. Stupid nails. You know the patient that I spoke to you earlier about? Yes, yes, I do. Sir, he's right around the corner. Right here? The victim of a vicious lion attack. Really? Oh, my. It's awful. Mm. Now, there's no cranium damage, mm. but he's been comatose for over 15 hours. Are there any injuries to the upper spinal region? None that we know of. Okay, well, I will check him out and uh, see what I can do. God bless you, Bob Mead. By the way, how's that latest excursion? I'm out? glad you asked, George, because I think I'm on the verge of a breakthrough. You mind? Oh, not at all. Thank you, in fact. Helga? My name is Dr. Wachenstein. I am a visiting neurosurgeon specializing in severe comatose conditions. Oh, and this is my nurse, Helga. Helga, would you check the uh, patients for his vital signs, please? Yes, sir. Excuse me, didn't I see you in a movie? Which movie? You didn't see that one. And you, oh, are you a patient or a relative? No. Do all of your movies have dinosaurs in them? He doesn't have any family, just his guardian, Uncle Bob, over there. Him? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Helga, did you hear that? This is his only living relative. Oh, sad. You know, I'm going to try everything I can to help bring your friend back, and possibly you could help me with that. Okay, how? Well, well in cases of severe comas, we not only treat the body, we also treat the psyche of the patient, you see, so you must tell me everything you know about him. For example, for example, was he a well-adjusted person? Oh, yeah. Any, any, any fits of anger or depression? No. Doctor, doctor, we have a big problem here. Here, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, yes, his heart has uh, resuscitated. No, Michael, no! Oh, mommy. If he wakes up now, he's going to have a heart attack for sure. Oh. I'm sorry, I'm really sorry. I, I did all I could. No! That's it? He's dead? It's an untenable twist of fate when God takes someone so young and innocent. But you must remember that he is going to a far, 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 far better place. Helga, take me to the morgue. <laughs> and don't try to revive me. Don't worry, I won't. Oh. Finally, what did I do to piss you off? Hey, Cam. What up, dude? <laughs> my gun, 
My gun just yelled at me because I haven't used it in a while. Jetpack? Oh, certainly. Oh, I can help. Uh, I can help. What this is? Jetpack suits. Reservation card. I want the actual jetpack. That's just a reservation card. Right? I don't know what I need to rock uh, jet pack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that Burgess in. Okay, great. So where where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This Burgess is final. Fuck, goddammit. Okay, well, let's, let's just give Gene the update. Okay. I hope you enjoy it. Shoot the hook bug, that's probably somebody's pet. Hello, this is Blurto from the food stand near your house in Blim City. Iraq, yes. Dude, I love this game. So much fun. So chill, dude. I love the Rick and Morty vibes. You can literally watch movies in this house here. How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but it's on back order. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? Gene's right. That, that, that sounds like a good idea. So you can actually... Let me, you can actually chill here and just watch movies. You can change the channel. I don't know how. Intensive care. That's room 203 down the hall. Come on. Oh, it's he's fine. You he's got the rest. he's got the clicker. All the characters look unique. Yeah, definitely. It is actually a movie. You can change the channel, but uh, he's got the clicker right now. Usually, I can change the channel. Let's see. And I'm pressing all my all right, buttons, don't do this but now. Just go sit down. I think he's got the clicker right now. Is it? Uncle Bob, it's my partner? I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry. I, I, I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up. Let, let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all of space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. Glubs day. <laughs> Blurbs day. Swibs day. What 
is this? I just got an achievement? Obtain the jetpack. Alright, partner, let's take this jetpack we'll for a spin. Stick drift or something? That gap? Okay, hold A and reply to the thing by room tell. Holy shit, this rules! Buy right now. I'll, bu I'll buy pill people. Oh, check out that landing, goddamn! Man, what time is it? No one is talking about that jetpack fucking rules. Let's head home and try it out on a new bounty. I'm good to go. Uh, cool. I may make the world Am I far into the game? Uh a little bit, yeah. I beat I beat a few oh, bosses already. Best. I need you to clean it up. Before this is my, this my sister in the game. Oh, got a big date with this sad sack slim boy boy mouth. toy. Fuck off, Gene. Like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fuck more aliens than your brain could comprehend. And That's even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot though, right? They still haven't fixed the audio bugs in this game, so she's talking right now, but it got really, no, really super you're right. quiet. Her boyfriend's ugly. Ask yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great. But you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. What about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, uh, look. Uh, we spent all this time living doesn't together. happen a whole I, lot, I care but about you now, Leslie. every now and then it gets kind Leslie. of annoying. Come on, tell her I care about her. I haven't played this game in forever because I thought they'd fix it by now. See, now it got quiet again. I think it's just an Xbox thing, probably, so if you play it on PC, you'd probably be okay, but... The fact that I'm a fuck-up degenerate is exactly why you should let me school you on life decisions. I, I know better than anyone what not to do. Both assholes. Yeah? Well, you're going to get this tweed guy pregnant. And then I'll be here to tell you I told you so. And who's going to have to deal with all your mutant kids running around this house? Me! Not that it matters, but I'm the one who would get pregnant. Not the way his species works. They get pregnant real easy. Wait, you think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady <laughs> job. Dick. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off. Just grow up and get used to me and Tweeg. Come on, tell Gene I can date whoever I want. Oh, fine, yeah. Team up against the depressed. They really need to fix it, dude. I thought it'd be fixed by now. I, mean, I, I haven't played this game in like a month or more. Har, har, har. Okay. Sorry to drag you into all that. Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Club is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. And Jill came tumbling out the. Carrie and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell down and broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. At night, when the mask is off, I look at myself. Yeah, hopefully, dude. It, it happens with, like, not just here, but, like, also in some of the quest lines where you're talking to people. They just get, like, so quiet you can barely hear them. It's. Yeah, this game is a trip, dude. Look 
thing at ten. I just thought maybe my mom and dad would be with you. Yes, I have tried Get everything. Bomb in. Well, I told her I'd be here before the end of this week. So once you defeat all the bounties, you beat the game. So I'd say I'm about almost halfway through the game. Looks like I'm about halfway. Get another TV? Oh, this one's not on. Oh no! saying to go that way. So confused. I just came all the way down here. Yeah, music, music's designed this way. It is pretty weird though. Guess I went the wrong way. Yeah, I think I went the wrong way.
all the way up there. It's like, I don't know if I can go through that poison sludge. It's kind of like a platformer, in many ways it's like a platformer. Oh. All these things push me back. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not making it. Yep. How to get up there. Sniper? You get headshots like they get decapitated, it's pretty cool.
grand at last, huh? Oh, you're the bounty hunter who helped us out with all that paperwork and killed my boss, Krubus. <laughs> we really appreciated that. But sorry, I'm pretty I sure I haven't even killed Krubus yet. Here. Just my job, nothing personal. You're uh, gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. So, can I kill you for that? No. That alarm. Take a look around this place, you know, see what kind of experiments they're doing here. Oh shit, well, what the fuck are they- Would you like to do the honors? What's We're good, Kyle? To show up those cocky nerds What's good, buddy? How you doing, man? Human with some you, other you, you the dub Jack master, the Kyle. The dub uh, master. No, you, you know, I, I don't think we're qualified to, to, to make that decision. Look. 
I can do it myself if you don't want to. I'm just trying to be nice. Bodies in there. Pretty cool. It's a human too. It's like the first human I've seen in this entire game so far. Hello, Johnston. It's Dr. Gurgill. I've been asked to send you some of my findings on the human genome. It's only a small portion, and I doubt you'll even be able to comprehend what you're looking at. But I promised Garmantua as I'd provide it. And now please don't contact me again. I'm busy. This Dr. Gurgler guy creeps me out. What? I get a new gun? Creature? Let's oh, go. Hey, you look nice. My name's Creature. The bad guys did experiments on me and fucked me up real bad. In basically <laughs> every way you can imagine. Holy shit, am I glad to see another cat laying alive in here? Uh, are there any others? Oh my god, yes! There's so many! Oh, but unless you've been alive, then no. These fucking gene green bastards. Creature, we're taking on the cartel. You want in? me against my will, cutting me open, doing experiments on me. Okay, you know what? Saying it out loud, I think they might actually be bad. I'm part of your team now. Hell yeah. Welcome aboard, uh, creature. That, 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 that's your name? I guess so. Oh, hey, we're locked in. That's fine. Don't freak out or anything. I could give birth to a bunch of little freaks and they could just say, ah, beautiful. Look out, one of my little fuckers just saved us. Being a dad is the best Shoots feeling in the world. Then a few seconds later, when a human kid dies because it has a microscopic lifespan, that's not so good of a feeling, actually. But I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's one of my children. They die fast. Don't worry. Will they multiply? Can it feel Pretty cool. Good? God, I love them so much. <laughs> Pretty cool because there's helpful? puzzles like that. that I gave birth to a lot of tiny guys I like puzzles. All right.
things to merge? Hello again! Holy shit, you killed everyone? Wow, you are strong. Good thing I'm safe behind this glass. Oh, use one of my kids to fuck with that guy's mind. He'll go into a frenzy. Oh, oh, and if you keep piling my kids on top of a guy, they can do mind control shit. They can make a bad guy fight for fun. Oh, shit. That mind control thing doesn't last very long. Sorry about that. I keep yelling at my kids to make it last longer, but they're shitheads. They do not listen. See you at the gym, Kyle. Or see you at the gym, Cameron. <laughs>
damage of them too. Something guilt free, you know? Thank you for letting me get some beauty sleep in.
killed everyone here, so I don't know how I can't get that time crystal. How's it going for you? Ready, willing, and able. That's Angela's Scrindle. Wanna kill him? Oh, fuck. The bounty hunter. Holy shit, is that another Scrindle? The, 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 they're getting away. Item obtained. Was this a movie or something? Jazz and Kevin's fun of the double teaming. Interesting. I've never got an item from one of those chests before. Hey, what's on TV? Uh, I guess it's supposed to be porn. Oh, what the hell? What, what is this? What is this? Why is it here? I'm trying to jack off. This is really distracting to me, but I'll still be able to do it. Trust me, I, I've been through a lot. Uh, I guess it's supposed to be porn, but it's like alien porn, so uh, I don't know. I, I honestly have no idea what I'm watching. I mean, I was able to get off to it, like, after a while. Um, honestly, no, I'm just not sure why they want me to go for it. Where did he go? The Scrindle, where did he go? 
ready to go. Hey, asshole, we can see you hiding in there. No, you can't. Fuck off. Let's fuck shit up. Fuck you. Hey. God damn it. Why do they keep running? That's it! There's no more running! I wasn't running! Yes, you were! Whatever! Fuck you! Nice work.
you too. So get the fuck out of this shit. going down. Just disappeared? Are you kidding me? What are you doing? Get get us out of here!
achievement, who's the boss? Gotta beat the Skendo Brothers, let's go. Killed the Screndel brothers and freed us again. Thank you. Thank you. Everyone else is too traumatized to talk right now. Sorry. We just keep getting captured over and over again, you know? It's a lot to take in. I'm still able to talk because I've been captured the most. I'm just kind of numb to it now. Means nothing to me anymore. You're really on fire, aren't you? Obviously, you're not as good at bounty hunting as I used to be, but hey, I'm gloppy enough to admit you're doing pretty damn well. Turn in that bounty. Yeah, I actually wanted to run something by you. How would you feel about me maybe fixing up my old bounty hunting ads? Maybe putting you in them to drum up business? I mean, my name will still be bigger than yours in the logo, but we'd be stupid not to capitalize on your growing reputation. Yo, you guys are fresh out of Frendelos. Oh, hey, I I'm Tweak. I'm dating your sister. Uh, this fucking guy. Tweak, you need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You're just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my friendalos and tongue kiss your sister? I'm the one who bought those fucking friendalos. And leave Tweak alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. I can go. No, Tweak. You're staying. Tell him he's staying. Look, he doesn't even love you. He's just after our house. It's our house. Exactly. Hey, Tweak, you gotta be careful around Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. You'd be a heartbreaker. I'd get out now while you're still in the green. And hey, you want a real lover? Talk to me. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. Oh, Not you, Twig. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do you, do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really advanced level holes. You really gotta date my nephew instead. His holes are more your speed. Shut the hell up, Gene. I am sick of your shit. All you do is sit on our couch and mope about how sad your life is. You're a leech trying to eat all of our friendalos and use the only family I have left to relive your glory days. Hey! 
Your family's doing a great job. You know how hard it is to kill that many high-level bounties in such a short amount of time? I mean, it's not as fast as I could have done it, but, uh... I know they're doing a great job, and I'm proud of them. But I'm stuck here dealing with you all the time, and you're fucking pathetic! Tell them how pathetic he is. Until then, no complaining about who lives here. Lives here? He's gonna live here? I mean, if you think we're ready, Tweeg. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Hey, shut up, Tweeg. This isn't about you. Why? Because you're worried you'll have to share a cushion? No! Because I... Because I'm concerned. We barely know this guy. And it's dangerous out there for humans. Oh, that's rich and condescending. I am not an idiot. I know what I'm doing. You're cool with Twig moving in, right? This is a mistake. To, <laughs> to, to kill him? <laughs> yeah. Anybody got a fucking problem with that? Eesh. Sorry I said anything. Let's just get back to the bounty hunting. Can't wait to show you those new commercials. A jill came tumbling out the... Carrie and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Carrie fell down and broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. At night, when the mask is off, I look at myself. I may make the world think I'm happy, but I can't hide the truth from myself. Whatever happens, I must go on acting, acting, acting. Be a polyachola. <laughs> Okay, okay. I just thought maybe my mom and dad would be with me. Yes, I have tried everybody now. Well, I told you I'd be here before the end of this week. Okay, I'll try not to. Thank you. 
Thank you. 